Good afternoon from Port Canaveral, where we're here to board the Disney Wish for the third time now. Yeah. Because we did a back-to-back -back cruise back in 2022. Yeah. We're making our return in 2024 to the Wish. The last time we were on this ship, we got engaged. Yes. Now we're married. Very windy. It's very windy. <laughs> it's kind of chilly because it's February. Yeah. So now we're going to go back on to the Disney Wish and we're inviting you guys to join us on this four night cruise to the Bahamas, a spontaneous four night cruise. Let's go. My road to platinum. Yes. Go. Yes. Canaveral is a breath of fresh air. We did Vancouver not too long ago on the Disney Wonder and it was very different. It's kind of nice being it. You just drive up, yeah. they take your stuff, you tip the nice man, and you drive into the parking garage. Yeah, it's not like uh, Vancouver where we completely missed our baggage drop. Yeah. We were even also though, in the hotel though. Even though we got the hotel, we paid good money to be right there and yeah. still forgot it. <laughs> oh, not wow. today. So one of the perks of coming later at 1.30, staterooms are available. That's the time we were booked for is 1.30. Yeah, so. our port arrival time was 1.30. Couldn't get earlier, I tried, but it worked out. Yeah. Yeah. I feel like I'm more excited than the last time because I know what to expect. Yeah, expectations like, are like, you, you know what you're getting into. And like, it was so much anticipation. Now I'm just excited to like cruise. It's time to relax. Yeah, I want to relax. We don't have to explore every part of the ship this time. I mean, yeah. <laughs> Why? I don't like the not clapping. <laughs> Why? Hello. Oh, Thank you, you got to get yourself a wand. He's our Cinderella. Oh, yeah. Look okay, at how beautiful this ship is. This used to be the tile mosaic that said the wish, but now it's just the carpet that you find in the atrium. I hear they took it out recently and they're working on it. Maybe it'll come back. I hope it does because it was actually really pretty. I'll put a picture in it now of what it looked like before. We are in the corner. <laughs> yeah, we're in like this like alcove here. We're not terribly far down. Here we are in our veranda stateroom Aww. again. We got Cinderella. Very cool. Cinderella it is. Yep, same gifts as the last time. <laughs> oh, it just doesn't say a Nagi roll anymore. No. Yeah, that's the only difference. No. Cool. But. Yay. Soon you'll be getting platinum gifts. The door just shut. And oh, wow. All the way over here. <laughs> Noted. Noted. Make sure, Make sure the door is closed. <laughs> wow. That's nice. Beautiful day. Yes. At Port chilly. Canaveral. So we're going to give you a quick tour of the stateroom. Not going to go too in depth on our veranda room because we kind of stayed on this ship. Actually, I think we stayed next door. Next door. <laughs> yeah. Like two years ago. Like literally, it's yeah. the same type of room but inverse yeah. or mirrored. So we're going to give a quick tour in case you haven't seen it. But if you want to see that video, we'll link it in the description box down below. But let's get on with the tour. So when you come into the room, you've got your toilet right here. And uh, I mentioned before that there is a nightlight feature that turns this light on down here and then the main light. So it definitely illuminates the area. 
And then, oh, speaking of which, still using H2O, but with the Disney sticker on it, kind of like what they did on the uh, Wonder. You got your thermostat, very simple. Minus is cold, plus is warm. Turn that down. <laughs> okay. It's hot in here. And then you got your shower. So the Wish shower is very different than the other ships. It's like a walk-in shower. If I recall, this door can go in and out. Oh my God, I was like, what's that noise? <laughs> and once again, H2O Plus, just with the Disney Cruise Line sticker on it. And then the bedroom. Sounds like a basketball gym. It's very sweet. <laughs> and then you got your USB ports on the side, your lights. This room is themed to Cinderella. You got this beautiful Wish foot blanket, I guess a footer blanket. And then this does fold out into a bed if you need that. Once again, more outlets and inputs. Actually, it looks like you get a little bit more on this one than you do on the other one. And then your whole armoire with a drawer that's got some postcards in it. Cabinets and drawers. And you got a fridge right here. And then the balcony. So let's go check out the balcony. Open this up. And a view of Port Canaveral. And you got the lifeboats right here. And directly below it is deck four, which you can kind of see right down there. All right, let's go check out the storage for clothing hangers right here. So the storage situation is still the same as it was. Probably shove all yeah, you could probably things. throw that up there. Well, create some extra. Actually, maybe not. Maybe not. <laughs> Can you put it up at the top here? Yeah, you can put it up here. Yeah, we're not gonna. Yeah, we we should probably do that. And then here's your life preserver. It's oh. Got a whistle in case you get. Don't case touch you. the whistle unless you absolutely. And then need it's it. got a light so they know where you're at. Hopefully we never ever have to use these. <laughs> have this slide to open. I don't remember seeing that before. Oh, oh, that's right. This is that weird. Yeah. Oh, it's so different. Oh, look at these robes. Yeah, I'll be using that. What does it say on there? Oh, it's just the Disney Cruise Line logo. Yeah. That's They're it. The cheapo ones. Yeah, not the nice ones that <laughs> they have in the gift shop. <laughs> and that's pretty much it. That's that's the room tour as Jen fights the door. <laughs> I guess they don't roll around as much in yeah. rough seas. Oh, All right. So yeah, that's pretty much our uh, room tour. A very quick and dirty room tour. Um, we're still waiting on our luggage to come up. Yeah, um, I saw a guy rolling. Oh, luggage. did you? Okay. Yeah, he's, he's working. And we got Paulo first night dinner tonight. We yeah. have not done Paulo Steakhouse, which is exclusive on the Wish. Yeah. Hopefully my luggage so. comes. Yeah, because you got your 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 nice clothes there. Yeah. When is Paulo dinner tonight? Six. Six o'clock. We got plenty of time. We'll be we'll be out at sea at that point. So okay. hopefully our luggage <laughs> comes then. All right. So Jen's gonna give us a quick tour of the magnets she made. I made these. Yes, you did. I printed them out. You want to give us a Cut tour? Cut them. So, what are better wish than these guys? Mm -hmm. Cinderella mm -hmm. and the Blue Fairy. Got our Disney wish. This is my birthday cruise. It is not actually my birthday, but we can never get a cruise or time off during my birthday. Spring break. So, <laughs> spring break, baby. Wish star, can't go wrong. Couldn't not do Chip and Dale. <laughs> got that. And then we got Thomas the Sailor Cat. Thomas the Sailor Cat. Yep, I made one. Cruising along with us. Yeah. And then the tourist trick. Yeah. And then our other things in our luggage, so that'll go yeah. here. Oh, that's right. We, mm -hmm. Our little project we made is gonna yeah. go right there. We'll see that later though. Yes. So the luggage has arrived, except the only one that's missing is my actual luggage. Your big one. That, that's an empty case for, 
for souvenirs, if there are any souvenirs on this cruise. Probably not as much. No. No. But you got your your luggage. You're all packed up. Yep. Or unpacked, I should say. <laughs> yeah, I am. But there is a fun surprise in here. A project we've been working on. Let's check it out. You want to share it? <laughs> <laughs> some other oh yeah, this one. Some oh, stuff no, got, got a little you got a little wrinkled a little that curved. magnet oh yeah i made my own yeah we usually get one of these made every cruise but we just didn't have time on this one so last minute that um we didn't so this is our project yeah check little. it out it's gonna go on our door yeah pretty neat and it shows like the tourist trek and cruising since 2014 that's me and then all the cruises we've been on this is the one that started our youtube channel mm -hmm. then the halloween on the high seas and then everything after that we've documented yep and uh we got the wish at the bottom here yeah the new one so this is 10 you're at this is your 10th cruise platinum, your platinum. baby platinum Mm -hmm. all right and then eventually there'll be a treasure down there somewhere at the bottom yeah <laughs> Oh, that's perfect. Look at that. That's it's cool. like really perfect. That's cool. It's got some dangly bits, but that's okay. That's for future cruises. Yeah. So we made it to the top deck for the sail away party called Set Sail on a Wish. It is by far the best of the sail away parties, in my opinion. And what'd you get there? You got some rose. Vanderpump. Okay. I don't even watch that show, but I know the name. Okay. So I got it. I got the drink of the day, which is the Mai Tai. Mai Tai on a Disney cruise. <laughs> Not gonna lie, those drinks, that pineapple drink, it's pineapple Dole Whip and strawberry daiquiri. Looks amazing. It just comes with a souvenir cup. I don't think I really need all that. And it's rum. It does look really good though. I'm so excited to have you on board for the next four fun filled things. And we want to meet you. Soon we will be setting sail. Until then, let's keep this party going with some deck dance floor magic. Faces. And I see so 
escorting us out. Yep, this is our port pilot right here. Pretty cool. No dolphins today. I think it's too cold. Yeah, it's a little chilly. We've for the seen dolphins. plenty of dolphins out of this though. Like, yes, remember the last time we were on yeah, the Yeah, that's right. That's they were right. jumping all over the place. Yeah, we were towards the front. Yeah. Remember? yeah. And then we watched it on our balcony on yeah. the second one. Yeah. It's pretty fun. All right, and you'll see the green buoys that's guiding us out into the Florida Straits. All you hear is the Mickey and Minnie, like the. the oh, they're laughing from the. <laughs> <laughs> from the aqua mouse. It's all you hear every like two seconds. Yeah, I, don't, I would presume this is not a very relaxing spot to look No. Out. <laughs> there it is, the port pilot. I, I feel like I always cover the port pilot at every cruise we go on. You do. I find it fascinating. We did find a video of him coming on and off. Not a Disney ship, but like. It was a royal ship. It was yeah. uh, Wall Street Journal. Yeah, it was They covered cool. the port pilot job of a poor pilot. Pretty fascinating stuff. So we're in Mickey's mainsail. We gotta go over the merch, as you know. We've got our Disney Cruise Line. I like this one, it's cool. $79.99. You've got your sleeves with the logo. And the front is just the blue logo. If you like shorter sleeves, this is good. $39.99. I like this too, it's very cute, <laughs> love it. It's got little stripes on the side. And it says Disney Cruise Line. That's kind of nice. $54.99. Are these those new? No, this is the fake You're lug. You're thinking of the lug bag. Lug bag, yeah, but it's the Disney version. $34.99. I like the ombre of it. The ombre? Yeah, it's $34.99. That's nice. And it's got the Cruise Line patch on the side. Oh yeah. Yeah, I like that. It matches the hoodie. Shirt and hoodie, you could just match all around. <laughs> it's got your cruise line. $49.99. That's the only pattern part of it is right there. You're missing the bucket hat. I love a bucket hat. Good old bucket hat. Ooh, it's almost like, uh, it's a lighter material, it feels like. $29.99 and I bet it's reversible. Mm, I don't like that version. It is not reversible. No, I'd say it's this <laughs> way. Why would they put all that pattern on that side to not have it reversible? I don't know. Hmm. The same pattern and colors as the anchors here. You got some mini ears. They're not cruise line specific though. But if you're curious, the price is nothing. No price. <laughs> so I don't know if this made it into the parks or not, but look how cute it's Pluto as the dog from Pirates. <laughs> He's $24.99. I think that's adorable. His little head can't handle the keys though. <laughs> and then you got Mickey too. And you got Pirate Stitch. You're forgetting Pirate Stitch. I'll get him. I've seen him before. But look how cute he is. His little okay. floppy sword. Yeah, $34.99. I don't know. I think that's so cute. All right, we'll go over Stitch. <laughs> his teeth are like extra yellow. But at least his sword stays up. <laughs> $24.99. teeth freak me out. This is $10 more. Mickey's $10 really? more. Really? Well, this is cruise line specific. This is pirates specific. Pirate plushy. <laughs> yeah. I don't know if that makes a difference. So we found some ears that are pirates, but also Disney Cruise Line. It's There's cute. no price, so. Is it on the back of the? It wasn't on the other ones, no. Hmm. No. Nope. So it's pick your own price, and I pick a dollar. <laughs> and in case you're interested, they do have some health and beauty items tucked away in the very, very back. We've gotten stuff from here before that we've forgotten, like sunscreen mm -hmm. or allergy medicine or whatever it may be, so. I got stuff for everyone. Yes. Um, this is like the best thing ever. Yeah, you know, I saw this on Twitter. Yeah, so it's, it's a the- towel animal plushie. Yeah. <laughs> That's so cute. So you got the monkey here. He's $26.99 and he's got the cruise line, which I love, I love 
Yeah. That and that he's got sunglasses. Wait, <laughs> he's got eyes under there. Oh yeah, you're right. <laughs> the best one though is the elephant plushie. I love him. That's so funny. Twenty six ninety nine. It's iconic to Disney oh, here's Cruise Line. Oh, the Cruise Line logo on the leg. Oh, yeah. Yeah. And then he's got little eyeballs. Because of all those fun yes. towel animals. Are these the only two that you saw, on, or is there different ones? I think I only saw those two. Okay. I don't want to miss out. No. New Spirit Jersey. You might not <laughs> think it's new, but it sure is. Jen would know. I've already purchased it. <laughs> it's Rapunzel. Yeah, it's the stern. Yep. We thought it was weird that all the other ships had this and the Wish did not. Yeah. The Wish had its own unique one. I don't remember how much I paid for it, but there's no price. If I remember, or if I still have the receipt, I'll put it down below. <laughs> so now, now you have a have all of them. spirit jersey for every ship. Yes. So this is the one that they had on oh, yes. the inaugural sailing. Yes, so I have that one already. Yeah, which I thought was weird. It was like... It was Why very not? different than the other ones. Why not do the stern? Right? So I'm glad that they did a stern one because mm -hmm. this one, it was the oddball out of the bunch. Also glad they had my size. <laughs> so they have the Wish lounge fly. I have the Wonder. The only difference is this part. Yep. Mm -hmm. Everything else is the same. That's why I'm not purchasing it. <laughs> surprise, that's a big surprise. I'm sure to a lot of people, but it's fine. <laughs> Innards check probably gonna be the cruise line logo yeah it's the same it's the anchor and the yeah yeah oh they they stuff this one tight <laughs> 78 dollars 78 dollars yeah so we have this shirt here it says setting course for adventure and it's got all the ships on there and the front has where magic meets the sea it's 39.99 hmm. i like the back i don't love the front yeah i'm with you yeah I know we saw this on our prior sailing, but it's still here. It's Rapunzel painting your ears. Hmm. How um, much? No price. Oh no, this one has thirty-four ninety-nine. So I'm assuming the other ears are around that price. Could be wrong. And check out the door magnets. Yes. It's all the sterns of the ship. No price. Oh look, and it even shows you on the back. What to do if you need some creative ideas? Nah, you just shove that on the <laughs> on the door. I do like that though. I'd probably, whatever ship I'm on, I'd bring that magnet. Yeah, that's kind of cool. And do it that way. Uh, so this throw blanket is um, sixty nine ninety nine. It's got all our favorite ships. It's really Super soft. soft. Yeah. It's like that. that that's uh, like Sherpa. quality. Cuddling, blanket, yeah. cuddling quality. Yeah. <laughs> we have too many blankets at home. So we have the Disney band, not magic band, although you can use your magic band on the ship. It doesn't have a price and you have to see a cast member for assistance. Yeah, it says here that you can get access to your stateroom and the kids club with it, tap to play at merchandise locations, and easily capture your cruise photos. This is really cool. So it is a wine bottle topper stopper <laughs> and charms for your wine glass so you put it around your wine glass and then you can store it in there when you're not using it mm. so if you have from some friends over with some wine you'll know what cup is yours okay revolutionary <laughs> how much 22.99 okay apparently i'm all about the novelty kitchen items <laughs> it's a salt and pepper shaker and a little as funnels and you can put them in there. <laughs> it's so fun. It's $24.99. Like how fun is that? I want all of it. <laughs> so we found a new Christmas ornament. It's got Mickey. It's for the 25th. Yeah, but it wasn't out during the 25th. No. Uh, it's price. It's on the little right there. $29.99. Okay. Then you got your other, oh, this is fun. That's a cute one. For the Christmas? Yeah, and then the other side's the hmm. ship. It's $29.99. Um, that's kind of fun. <laughs> I like that. It's like a Santa sharp. Oh. Not sharp sharp, but sharper than I thought. And it's $24.99. That's nice, I like it. 
I kind of really like it actually. <laughs> it's so cute. Okay, so we found some fun pins. Yeah. This one. Yes. All our favorite ships. Like it. It's limited release. Seventeen ninety nine. Which means it's only out for a certain period of time. Yes. Chippendale. <laughs> They're so cute. I'm peeking through the porthole. Yellow. Whatever yellow is. <laughs> and how this fun is that? Fun. I like that a lot. Yeah. Mickey Mouse Castaway Key. That's funny. Silver, whatever that is. That's really fun. And then here's some of the pins they have. Other pins. Yeah. Here's some of the other pins they have. I love that. <gasps> it's got the tail animals. <laughs> <laughs> they got some unique ones. This they one's do. a unique one. What's that? That oh, it's one's the a pool. unique one. Yeah, they got unique ones that ice cream. Oh. From Dream Not and Fantasy. Ship, yeah. Oh, and then some castaway clubs at the bottom. Oh, yeah. And they have the stern pin. Look how perfect that is. Oh, my goodness. Cinderella. Mm. And then Captain Minnie. Oh. And you got Captain Mickey, Captain Minnie. I like this one with all the oh, friends. Oh, yeah. The Aqua Mouse. Uncharted Adventures. Oh, yeah. Uncharted Adventures. And then we bought this Make-A-Wish pin. They and they an still inaugural. have inaugural sailing pins here. Interesting. I don't remember that like one. Like two years later. <laughs> yeah. Wow. And then here's the price points in case you're curious. Then you've got your 2024 pins to go with the 2024 line. Vacation Club has a pin. Oh, yeah. And then your standard pin fare. Yeah. Lounge fly alert. Lounge fly alert. Look how fun. And it is a lounge fly. And it's a backpack. Like, you could probably hold it like this, <laughs> but like, you can wear it on your back, which I didn't realize because someone <laughs> was wearing it. Inner's check. I have too much in my pins. It's the logo with Mickey. <laughs> and it's priced at $98. Dang. <laughs> That's a hefty Is this see-through? Like you take this out and you can see in it? I think it is. Yeah, because look, this is like oh, cardboard. Yeah. yeah, it's see-through. So you can see through it. I don't, I don't know, know if, if I, I like that. that. <laughs> Jinx. <laughs> yeah, owe me a Coke. <laughs> then we got this one. Oh yeah, this one. I like that one. It is cute. I like the velvet, the navy velvet ears. Yeah, the bow. $75. Sorry, the bow, yes, the bow, not the ears. Innards check. <laughs> Too much stuff. It's so much easier. Oh, that's nice. I like that. Yeah. Anchors. So have I ever seen inside the Stitch one? I don't know, but I'm very curious. All right, let's do it. Stitch, that's actually a really cute one. <laughs> he is $88. My lander got stuck. It might be easiest to show you here. Innards check. Innards check. I'm struggling with the innards today. <laughs> oh, how cute. That's really adorable. <laughs> That's probably the best innards I've seen in a while. <laughs> now there is a big assortment of Wish merchandise, the movie Wish, because once again, this is the Disney Wish. They should add her in somewhere. Right? They got Star. They've got all sorts of shirts, the same stuff you'd see in the park. Yeah, nothing unique to the Wish. So this does not say Disney Cruise Line on it, but Cinderella is the atrium statue. Um, so they have these ears and they're so pretty. I like the clock in the middle. Yes, no price, it's priceless. Pick your <laughs> price, a dollar. And they got any. your Disney Cruise Line Nike hats. I think these were on the other ships, but. They are. $39.99, 40 bucks. And then your Disney Cruise Line hats, mm -hmm. captain hat, and they do have 2024 merch out right now. It is the same style as in the parks. Just cruise line theme. Just cruise line theme. And super vibrant. Yes. I have not seen this spirit jersey yet, and I'm debating it. Yeah? I am. It's black, not navy. Yeah, it's black. I That's kind of cool. I wish it was navy. Disney Cruise Line, and it's got the rope. You know what I like? Huh? It's in the font of the cruise line. 
That's true. You know how sometimes they just do like the normal? Yeah. Like this is in the font of the Cruise Line logo. Yeah. I get worried this is going to come off. How much is it? It's priceless. <laughs> <laughs> so we went into Treasures Untold where they have a new line of merchandise, newish line of merchandise called the Sail Away with Captain Mickey and Captain Minnie. What do you I think, Jen? I really like this. Yeah. I like all of it. Yeah. It stripes all around. It's by, um, designed by Ashley Eckstein and Brent. Yeah, there was a whole little, a little uh, spiel on that. Yeah. I was just reading up. Brett Ewan was uh, basically the iconic fourth official voice of Walt Disney, I'm sorry, of Mickey Mouse. A role first performed by Walt Disney himself, which I think is pretty cool. And Ashley Eckstein was recognized as an actress, author, designer, entrepreneur, host, inspirational speaker, and a producer. She's best known for originating the character of Ahsoka Tano. I told you that, and Star you didn't Wars. believe me. <laughs> it's pretty neat. Yeah. Let's see, Ashley founded a fashion and lifestyle brand, Her Universe. Oh, so that's her line. Okay. Yeah. I got this. I got this for my friend, but I kind of want one. Yeah, it's a cool sweater. Yeah, I kind of want one. And it's all embroidered too, which I like. All embroidered. Yeah. It's fifty nine ninety nine. It's actually not bad for all embroidered. I do like sweater. It. It's not bad. It's nice. And then you have the hat, which mm -hmm. I also very much really love. Twenty nine ninety nine. Twenty nine ninety nine. That might be coming home with me. We'll see. <laughs> what is this? That looks like it's a picnic blanket. You look on the tag and see it unfolded. Oh, I love that. $69.99. <laughs> to sail away with Captain Mickey. $49.99. Oh, that's soft. Is it? I love that. And then you got a backpack. The lug bag. Is it a lug bag? Yes. Oh yeah, you're right, it is lug. So there's many, many pockets. You've got one, two, <laughs> three, four, five. Holy cow. Six. Innards check. <laughs> oh, innards too. Six, <laughs> seven, seven pockets, man. Wow. Oh, eight. Eight. Wow. That's a that good spot a little... for your passport. There you go, those. right in your back. Yeah. How much is this? Let me zip up. <laughs> $95. Whoa. You have a small version, but you can put it on your belt. It says like a belt bag. Yeah. So you got one, also and it has a strap. As a fanny pack. Yes. <laughs> it's got a strap. So if you don't want to use it as a fanny pack. Yeah. Price? I got to open the other one. So it's got divider. Oh, and little pockets for your cards. Oh, interesting. $55. Okay. A little bit more doable. Yeah. And then you've got this shirt. With pockets Wait, on the dress. side. Is it a dress or a shirt? I think it is. Okay, and it's got pockets. Um, There's the price. $49.99. So this one goes on your luggage. It's a lug bag for lug your bag luggage. Food, yeah. Uh, this is the only one I see, but it is $65. You've got a nice... Innards chip. Inner, wow, that's nice. That's spacious. <laughs> you could fit your hairbrush in there. <laughs> and then you've got this pocket. And it's waterproof, this part. Like. Oh, yeah. And then you got two pockets here. One. And on the other side. And two. Yeah. I will say they're on top of their pocket game. And then it's got one here. My goodness. Pockets galore. All the pockets. I'll lose stuff. And then you can slide it on. Slide it on. Boom. Again, $65. And if you're interested in any of the 25th merchandise, even though it's long gone, it is still here on the Wish for sale. Doesn't say 25 though, so they can sell it however long yeah, they Yeah, right, want. that's true. 
you. All right, good. She stared hardcore at my thing. I know, I saw that. Yeah. Our luggage is here. Yes. We're there. All right, let me use my little... I love our door. It's I know, our door is very fun. Got a lot of magnets. Okay, so now we are out at sea. It is coming on six o'clock, which means it's time for our Apollo Steakhouse reservation. Mm -hmm. I'm excited. We've never been to Apollo Steakhouse. We couldn't get it on the last cruise. We couldn't get it on the last two cruises we were on because yeah. we did it back to back. We still couldn't get on. So now we're going to Apollo Steakhouse. First night dinner. But we're not gonna bring the camera along. We're gonna do it on our phones, kind of the old way we did it, and uh, discuss yes. here momentarily. So let's talk about Apollo Steakhouse dinner. Now, when you enter Apollo, you're actually gonna go to the aft of the ship. I believe it's on deck 11. And you're gonna go all the way past the Rose, which is the Beauty and the Beast themed bar, and very elegant looking. What's really cool is that all the seats, just like on the Apollo on the Fantasy in the Dream, all the seats face the ocean, which I think is really cool. Gives you a really unique perspective. It was nice to see the sunset while we were eating. I it know. got dark quick, though. On the menu, you could either go with the Prezzo Fizzo, which is the prefix menu for $50, or you can do uh, a la carte, which is where you kind of pick from the list, but then you go off the pricing. So they had plenty of options. Your traditional options that you typically find with Palo, but because it is a steakhouse, there is a lot of steak options as well. All sorts of beef such as Angus, uh, Prime Angus, and Wagyu, and Japanese Wagyu. Now we went to Palo Steakhouse on first night dinner and it was completely empty. And as per usual, the chef brought us a mushroom yoki to uh, open our palate for what's to come. And it was opened. Uh, we were chatting with him for like a minute once he put it down and he's like, get to eat and it's gonna get cold. <laughs> <laughs> I thought it was good. I felt like the mushroom yoki on the Wonder was more flavorful, but it was very good nonetheless. Then they brought out some bread. This bread. Call this, it pizza bread. This this green bread. <laughs> the green bread. Who knew green bed bread would be <laughs> so good? Like, it was like perfectly like salted and oily it was and lightly salted oh. and lightly oiled and had a lot of flavor i don't know how the uh, just salt and oil who knew yeah, it was very very good uh probably the best of the bread uh little appetizers that they put down so for our first appetizer we got the heirloom tomato burrata mozzarella caprese which is basil pesto aged balsamic vinegar man was this good he said the balsamic that he had is newer for the ship. Yeah, it's eight years old is what he said. Yeah, it was really good. We shared this appetizer because I was getting something special <laughs> and I wanted to have enough room. <laughs> yeah, so we, this the only thing that I noticed that was different is that they used different colored tomatoes on this one. The lighter colored tomato was really good. Uh, 10 out of 10. 10 out of 10? Wow. It was great. And I got the usual at Palo dinner. I got the panette, pasta, San Marzano, tomato, basil sauce, chilies, parmigiano, reggiano. And boy, was it amazing. It might actually be the best penne pasta I've had on any Palo dinner. He didn't even let it me was try it. Perfect. It was so good. And it had a nice kick to it. Compliments to the chef, Chef Mateo. It was amazing. The cheeses were fantastic. But you got something cool. I got the Japanese Wagyu. Oh, six yeah. ounce. Six ounce Japanese Wagyu. What'd you think? Oh, uh, it was so good. I'm not a steak person. I'm really, really not. When am I ever going to try Japanese <laughs> Wagyu? And I trust Disney Cruise Line that it is real Japanese Wagyu. And you're gonna, they're going to do it right. It literally yeah. melted in your mouth. I asked him, I said, I don't want to mess this up. <laughs> how, how should I get it cooked? So he told me and Oh my God, it melted in your mouth and it was so good. You tried it, what did you think? It melted in your mouth. Didn't yeah. understand the sensation until it happened. Was it the best steak you've ever had? Yes. Yeah, same here. And then of course we ended the night with a chocolate souffle. He did a little bit different. He told us, you know, you could always use the chocolate, but he insisted on using the vanilla with the chocolate. Even though his daughter's like, give me the chocolate. <laughs> so what'd you think? Oh, it was so good. I still think the first time we had the souffle was the best time. Ah, oh, yes, on the fantasy. Like, I don't know if it was just like that first time trying it feeling or what, but like, but it's still good. 
I, yeah. I want a gallon of that little vanilla ice cream they have. I agree. And because it was your birthday, they brought us the happy birthday Jennifer plate. Yeah. <laughs> All right, back in the state room. It's a little frog. What is it? It's a frog. It's a frog. A frog. A frog? A frog. Oh yeah, we've had a frog before. Yeah, that's a good one though. That's a good one. A really good one. That's a really good frog. Yeah. Very cool. So we're back at the room now. Um, after a, I don't want to say long day, because it didn't feel like a long day. It just no. boom, 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 boom. Uh, right when we left port, it was time to go to dinner, and then we had our dinner experience, which was amazing. Paulo's Steakhouse is fantastic. And check out the merch down at Mickey's Main Sale um, that got you your spirit jersey. Yes, spirit your, your jersey. Spirit, the official spirit jersey yes. of the Disney Wish. And then I got something my friend requested, which yeah. I actually might get one. We'll see. That was at the other store. Yeah. Um, I forget the name of that one. I can't remember it off the top of my head, but it's the one right across from the bayou. Yeah. Um, very, very cool. Um, but then we decided to come back to the room where we had our frug. A frug. And uh, we're going to call it a night. Yeah. So if you enjoyed the video, please give it a big thumbs up. And if you haven't yet and you want to join the vlog for future cruise vlog adventures, Jen, tell them what to do. Make sure to tap that subscribe button and tap that notification bell to become a super wishing subscriber. Until next time, see you real soon. Good morning. From Nassau, Bahamas. Mm -hmm. It'll be a fun day today. Yeah. I think today we might get off the ship to check out the new port because they did a whole revamping of the port of Nassau. Oh, oh no! no. Oh, that's cool. Ooh. Okay, so what are we doing now, Jen? Mickey's Uncharted Adventures. Which was not working and functional the last time we were on. Yes. Many, many issues with the, the app. game and the app.